Yes, sir. Chris Davis, Millbrook High School. To my left, Jalen McCoy. To my right, William Felton. Uh, man, this atmosphere was awesome. Uh, we, we enjoyed um, every minute playing here. Um, tonight's game was what I thought it would be, you know, a dogfight between two really good teams that um, that try to represent the state the right way. I've been knowing Coach Williford for a long time. He's a really good guy and he does it the right way and his kids play really hard. And I knew when we, we pushed out and got a lead, I knew they would come back and my kids' resiliency to stay in it was huge. Um, the incident where um, where Smith and, and Jalen had the had the incident they ran into each other. And, you know, um, Smith lost a tooth, unfortunately. And um, Jalen, you know, could have stayed out and could have, you know, not not came to battle, but for him to go get cleaned up and throw New Jersey on, I might switch him to 12 because I think he actually might play better than that. But um, for him to come back out there and battle was huge. And then um, Felton was uh, was amazing tonight on the boards, uh, scoring around the rim, and um, his teammates did a good job of finding him. And then when they didn't, he went and got rebounds. So we're really excited about the win. Um, two and one in this tournament is, is pretty special. Like I'm patting myself on the back for uh, for agreeing to do this because it definitely was good for us. And um, we're looking forward going into 2020. We're really excited about what we're going to be able to do. Very good question um, for Jalen and Will. You guys both had double doubles. They're obviously a great team with their guards. They have some size, but uh, you guys had a little bit of an advantage on the interior in terms of size. Um, what did you guys see down there in terms of you know being able to grab off the rebound? <laughs> our game plan was to um, beat them down low because they know they don't have as much size as us. So our coach told us to keep battling down there and it would be good for us. Yeah, and the main thing was just to like box out, rebound, because we knew they would shoot a lot. And as long as we like stayed on the boards, we'd stay up. Uh, early in the fourth quarter stretch, what did you guys do to kind of separate yourself from they were coming back? Um, we just got stops. I mean, I thought, you know, they made some – some crazy shots. I mean, you think about two kids making, two kids scoring 60 points out for them. I mean, they've made some crazy shots. I mean, so we just wanted to just kind of stay as solid as possible. When they did miss, we're gonna try to get it, make them pay in the other end. And I thought we did a good job of getting the ball to where we wanted to. And if we missed a shot, I thought these guys were all over all over the glass finishing. So uh, we got some great support from guys off the bench tonight to kind of help us with some things. Um, you know, of course, Zach Miller does what he does, but, but Parker Swisher tonight came in and gave us some really solid minutes, played some really strong defense, and, and scored a basketball for us. So that was huge, I thought. Coach, in terms of the slate you guys play here, you, know, you guys ran the Champion Private School, number one team in the country, and then you know, ran the Champion Public School that you was know, up there, according to most people, with you guys in terms of top state title contenders this year. Um, is that kind of an ideal slate for you guys to be able to measure yourself? Yeah, yeah, like we, we try we try even regular season for non-conference to try to play, you know, whoever we can because we, we want to we wanna build on what we're trying to do. We're not perfect. We know we got a lot of things we can fix between now and next Tuesday when we play Sanderson, but we just want to just try to continue to get better and then be, we want to be really good in February. Late February, early March is when we want to be at our peak. So right now just trying to build us up and, and games like this only help that, you know, going against a team – but so many athletes, and then two just elite, you know, three, I'm sorry, three elite, elite guards that really play the game well. So that helps us for down the line, whoever we might have to play. Will and Jalen, what does it mean to you guys to be able to represent Raleigh on this stage? You know, a lot of national attention and national eyes on you guys are doing here. It felt good. I thought we got some good exposure at this tournament. And Coach told us that it was going to be tough games, all three games, and it was. It also helped us to see how, how much better players are like all over the place and we got it we got chances to play like top teams that we wouldn't normally play. I think it's a good experience. What did you learn about your team this week, Coach? Um that that I already knew we liked each other, but just to handle the resiliency of what happened to us on Saturday playing against an elite team like that. And for the kids to fight and stay through it throughout the I, mean, I don't know if you guys know we were getting our butts kicked and they just kept playing. They did not stop playing. They didn't quit. They didn't hang their heads. And that, that to me showed that this was a, not only a great idea, it showed the growth of our team. Because normally in those things when kids are not doing well, they have sometimes to fade or to doubt themselves or, or quit or blame, but they didn't do that. They stuck the course, they stayed with it, we battled strong. We had a great morning as far as practice and going through what we were gonna do today. And we had a good energy as far as coming over here and they just got after it. So what I learned if anything else is these guys like being around each other. And we want to continue this on in, on into two twenty on, on, in, on into twenty twenty. Excuse me. Anybody else? Very good. Thank Congratulations. You. Congratulations.
thank you very much for everything. Appreciate it. Congratulations.